My name is Sage Lazaro. I'm a tech editor and writer, and I cover things like AI, space, um, emerging technologies, and how tech affects our culture and society. There are so many ways that AI and machine learning are changing the world right now and how they're affecting our lives. It's being integrated into nearly every field, every sector, you know, retail, banking, energy, healthcare and research manufacturing, supply chain logistics, enterprise software, entertainment, marketing, education. I could literally just go on and on. But you know, for an example, let's look at the smartphone. Everyone carries one and we think of, you know, Siri and voice assistants as AI, but there's so much more. Artificial intelligence is working behind the scenes on our smartphones in so many ways that we don't even see or notice. AI makes your phone camera understand depth and lighting and context for, for better better photos and videos. It gives us Snapchat filters. It reduces background noise on phone and video calls and it's behind translation capabilities being integrated into our lives in small ways that we're not even necessarily noticing. So AI has been really useful in space exploration, and specifically when it comes to exploring Mars. Since Curiosity, NASA has been using AI in this respect, and there have been big improvements with Perseverance, the latest rover. For example, while well, Curiosity would take images and they had to be downlinked to Earth, examined by human scientists, and sent back with commands saying, analyze this rock or do this. Perseverance is doing this autonomously and can decide which rocks would be interesting to scientists and study them on its own. So what used to take days just kind of happens now, which allows more data to be collected at more flexible times. And when Perseverance landed last month, it autonomously guided its own landing using NASA's new AI-powered terrain relative navigation technology. The new rover also features an enhanced navigation system with a new path by algorithm. This allows it to autonomously drive in more rocky and more challenging terrain so we can explore even more of the planet. It also uses AI for faster imaging processing and a new capability the JPL team calls thinking while driving. Picture how curiosity would, you know, take a step, stop, analyze an image, what's around it, and then continue. And that takes time. It would have to be stopped for a moment or two, a few minutes while it analyzed. Plus perseverance can do that all in one moment motion while it's driving and taking a step forward it's already analyzing that next step continuously so it doesn't have to stop it can just keep moving and moving and when i spoke to tara eslin the supervisor at jpl who's working on this stuff she told me that to have this capability they determine they need it in order to meet their goals for this mission